Alright. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I guess I'm just still trying to figure things out. Um, I don't know what to do with videos. Decided to just pick up the camera, film, and do a vlog today. And I'm actually heading into New York City right now. It's a workshop. Uh, several different speakers there. I'm actually driving in because if I were to take the train or bus right now, it would take like almost two hours just for me to get there. And driving only takes like 35 minutes. So I just need to find parking. Okay, so it's 801. Workshop starts at 9. It's from 9 to 6 today. And I'm trying to just get myself out of my comfort zone and just do it. Like I said, I'm still trying to figure out what I'm trying to do with these videos. I know I was doing Foodie Friday. I know I was doing those daily fitness tips video. Now I'm trying to go back to vlogging. I don't know. I really don't know. I really don't know. It's like, if I were to be honest with you guys, I don't know. And I'm trying to figure it out. So, if you've been a viewer on my channel, please be patient with me. If you're new here, um, I'm still trying to figure things out. I'm just going to record, be myself. And I think that would be the best in terms of creating video content and getting stuff out there. And I think that's the best way to actually produce content is by recording your day because there's a lot of things you miss out because when you have a certain topic you have to talk about you tend to focus on that topic and throughout the day there's like thoughts going through my head about a lot of different things so instead i'm just gonna do a vlog so i might be doing that from now on maybe like once a week just do a vlog i'm actually starting prep again for a powerlifting competition so maybe i might vlog that uh, that's actually six month prep and i'm starting actually tomorrow but let me get to driving because it's already 8.04. It's gonna probably take me 30 minutes to get there. But anyways, stay tuned, enjoy. All right, so just found parking. Parking in the city is rough, but luckily it's Sunday, um, a lot easier to find parking. And I'm not in the busy area in Manhattan right now, so. Walking over to the pier is actually by the water, the ship. That's where everyone's gonna be at. And that's where the workshops will be held. And it's probably a bit windy right now, so you, hopefully the audio isn't too bad. But uh, I don't usually go into the city. This is like a really rare occasion where I go into the city, but I told myself I would get out of my comfort zone and kind of just pick up the camera, record, and vlog the thing. Look at this horse. I always wanted to ride one of these things. But they're really expensive. Well, horsey. I guess this is where they uh, uh, this is where they park all the horses. It's like a horse lot for uh, Central Park. Hopefully, you can hear me. It's pretty loud in here. I'm gonna try to get some footage, of the event, and um, everything that's going on. I think there's workouts here as well, but. I'm mainly here for the speakers, not for workouts. A lot of speakers are going to be on this end of the event. They actually have a CrossFit competition going on. And people are actually going to be competing, but they asked me if I want to do some workouts, but I'm not here for that. I'm mainly here for the speakers, so we're going to head over there right now. It's funny, I had a, a business coaching client, she's amazing. She wasn't posting consistently and she's actually very nervous to go on Instagram Live. I was like, why are you nervous about going on Instagram Live? She's like, what if someone asks me a question that I don't know the answer to? I was like, what if you say, I don't know? It's like, God forbid you're honest and you say you don't know the answer. I think most coaches would do a lot better if they spend more time focusing on helping people regardless of the platform, regardless of the trend, regardless of what's going to happen in the industry. Focus more time on being honest, helping people, and starting out by doing it for free. Because if you do that for long enough, a year, two years, three years, you're going to help way more people than you could ever imagine, and you're probably going to have a business that's very successful. But if you saw some of my earlier seminars back in 1990, I just 
got back home, uh, to be honest, I couldn't really film at all when I was there at the event. Uh, I had some clips that you probably saw previously before I started speaking here. You probably saw it was too freaking loud. <laughs> like the, the place was not what I expected. Then the event was not what I expected. I really thought the place was going to be more intimate and it was going to be more of an intimate interaction with the people attending but ended up being like a whole CrossFit uh, event in the background or like some circuit event in the background and I didn't really get the time and the audio was going to be like crap you probably wouldn't gonna hear me, me at all unless I really yell into the camera or there was these brief moments where it was silent and then you can actually talk but by the time I turn on the camera and try to like film something uh, there was like a, an abrupt sound in the background and you're probably not going to hear me at all. So, I apologize for that. I was trying to make this a freaking better vlog. Uh, but now you just see me back in a car talking. But, uh, you know, I'm still going to upload it. I'm still going to upload it. Um, you're probably watching this right now. And it's just a way for me to start. It's a way for me to just uh, create content. So I might just uh, do still do those videos where... Uh, I talk about a specific topic. Might might not be on a whiteboard, because currently in the place I'm living in right now, like it's a little congested and it's not the best in terms of recording content because you can hear kids screaming in the background because I still live with my family. So you can hear, hear my niece and nephew screaming in the background, and it's probably not gonna be good for for me talking about educational topic when in the background all you hear is just kids screaming. So. That being said, hope you guys enjoyed this content. If you did, make sure you subscribe down below, like the video. Uh, it's gonna help this channel a lot, of course. Comment down below what you'd like to see in the future. Uh, and I'll see you guys next time, right? Later. Peace.